by Sophie Leach of Linwood, Kansas. Entry 631 placed fourth. 638 was fifth. And entry 634 was sixth in the class. Now entering the ring is our summer junior two-year-old cow class in our International Junior Holstein Show. The award in this class is presented by Go Show Cattle Company, the Schmucker family of Whitewater, Wisconsin. If you turn your attention to the International Junior Holstein Show ring, Judge Perry has completed his placings in our summer junior two-year-old class. Placing third in the class is entry, and also in the Brent Known Award, is entry 647, BJ Grove Unix Cherokee, exhibited by Casey Clanton of Mulberry Grove, Illinois. Second in the class is entry 644, Smile Air Elsa, exhibited by Zoe Ertel of Plymouth, Wisconsin. And winning the class is entry 649, Ms. Nabhol Samaris, exhibited by Kylie, Tyler, and Tristan Verthine of Altura, Minnesota. Congratulations. Brandon, your thoughts on the class? When you get to stand back here where Tyler and I are, that's quite a... Quite a lineup of rear otters all the way down the line. But for us, this white cow moving out in first really puts it all together with that beautiful mammary system and the balance and the blending of parts all the way through that frame. It's the balance and the blendingness all the way through that frame that gives her an advantage over our second prize cow. She shows us just a little bit more strength up through that front end. The width and the power and the, of, uh, the width and the power of muzzle, the width and the power of chest. She shows us a little more depth and capacity and strength up through that heart region. She's a cow that shows us a little more rise and extension right up through the top of that chine for us today and fullness through that shoulder today. Taking nothing away from our second prize cow, a cow that wears a beautiful mammary system, a cow that certainly has enough strength in her own right, just not quite as much motor as our first prize cow. But that cow in second does use that strength to get over our third prize cow. She is just a little bit more uh, tighter at the point of elbow, fuller through the crops for us today. She's a cow that... Uh, 
Shows us a little more uh, snugness to that four outer attachment, the way it blends up into the body wall. She's also a cow that's got just a little more capacity to that rear flank for us over our uh, black cow moving out in third. A real silky quality cow, a cow that moves out on a beautiful set of feet and legs. And it's that foot and leg, the way she steps down on that passion that gives us an advantage over our fourth prize cow. For us, she just shows, me, shows us a little more flex of that hock as she moves throughout the ring. She's shorter in that toe, she's deeper in the heels, she's stronger about the pastern as she steps down. Taking nothing away from this beautiful mammary system on our fourth prize cow. Fourth over fifth, it's that mammary system that gives her an advantage over this black cow. She just shows us a little more height and width at the top of the rear udder. Certainly more definition of seam all the way through that mammary system. But another real balanced frame cow, another cow that moves out on a beautiful set of feet and legs. Just not quite as much definition of seam and height and width as that fourth prize cow. Congratulations.